and my name is <laughs> yourself, okay? Let's go. Get the You're property. You're not allowed Let's to go. talk to me like well, this was the scene at the Spokane Valley Mall shortly after a group of teenagers were kicked out for sneaking into a movie. After they were caught, those teens say they were just waiting for the rides when a run-in with mall cops became uncomfortable. Good evening, I'm Mia Wong. And I'm Aaron Luna. Our Mayor Kawash spoke to the mother of one of those teens. And Mayor, what did she have to say? Well, at first, when she heard about the situation from her daughter, she just thought the kids were just acting out. But she became more concerned when she found out one of the teens does have epilepsy and actually passed out twice because of how heated the confrontation got. Go. No, stop! Go. Please, stop! A night at the mall takes a turn for the worst for a group of teenagers. Yeah, my name is <laughs> yourself, okay? Let's go. Let's go. You're not allowed to talk to me. Like the mother of one of those teens didn't want to be identified in the story, but she says her daughter and some other teenagers were just waiting for their rides home after being caught sneaking into the movies. Teenagers will be teenagers. They were not in the right in this video, but the situation could have been held a lot differently. The mother says one of the teens was on the phone with her parent when the mall cop demanded to talk to that parent on the phone. When the teen denied, the mall cop started going back and forth with the group, intensifying the situation. So how old are you, 12? No, I'm not 12. I'm 14. Oh, you're 14. Yeah, I'm 14. Oh, okay. And I'm videotaping you. An even bigger issue came along as one of the teens suffers from epilepsy and actually passed out twice in the midst of the heated exchange. The mother says 911 or any other medical assistance was not given to that teen. Instead, she says the mall cops continued to harass the group. It makes me mad because if she has a medical condition and they weren't getting her help, what if something bad were to happen to her? She hit her head on the ground. The mother says that teenager ended up being okay since the situation settled down. What if she had a concussion or didn't wake up? I mean, that's a big problem. She also says she made sure to talk to her daughter about how the situation could have been handled differently, but in the meantime, she's hoping the Spokane Valley Mall can do the same with its security. I mean, if they're going to treat everybody like that at the mall, um, no, I don't think they should have a job. But if they learn from it and be like, okay, we need to learn how to deal with these situations, then yeah, keep your job, but maybe handle it differently. And in fact, we just heard from the Spokane Valley Mall. They say they do not condone the behavior and that security is handled by a third party company. Now that third party company issued a statement saying the officer who was swearing throughout the video has been suspended. They say more discipline may follow once a full investigation is completed. Reporting live in studio, I'm Mayor Kawash for News Now.